been some interesting results this weekend in Spurs with a 3-1 win over Forest. Liverpool losing after that massive result at Anfield against Manchester United. There was a feeling, particularly on the FC show this week, and I hold my hands off, I'm among them, that we had to say which team was going to make the top four with the two Manchester sides and Arsenal. And everybody suddenly changed. Everybody was unanimous in saying it's going to be Liverpool, even though Spurs were holding on to that fourth spot when we were all asked. After the weekend's results, what are your thoughts on who's going to make up that top four? Well, I mean, there's so many unknowns about Liverpool and Spurs because they've been so inconsistent. And one team that, in my opinion, has been consistent are Newcastle United, even though they had a long run of, you know, of patchy uh, results, to say the least. Not necessarily losses, but a lot of draws as well and almost look as if as if they took themselves out. The one thing that I like about Newcastle is their consistency and defensive record. I mean, it's incredible. They're the best defensive team. And in a run-in like this, you can almost count that they're not going to be losing games. Alexander Isak scoring and looking good. It's a massive bonus because we all know that it's a it's a uh, probably the bad run is due to that uh, because they, they don't have a bona fide goal scorer. And I'm not saying that Isak is one, but at least he gives you hope. Uh, Miggy Almiron, a wonderful goal. I mean, he's had a, uh, remember that, 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 that spell where he scored in like six or seven goals and obviously benched in this game because he hasn't been in his best when I say that in terms of scoring, because the work ethic is second to none and that smile on his face, the love of uh, uh, St. James's Park is, is special between those two players. So that's a bonus for him to come and show, listen, uh, it's not going to be easy to put me on the bench. So I like Newcastle United from that standpoint. I really like teams that are so solid defensively. And now that Guimaraes is back, uh, I think the bad form coincided with the fact that he was out uh, um, for, what was it, three or four games. Um, so I like them the most because Spurs are inconsistent. We don't know what we're going to get from week to week. And sa same can be said about Liverpool. All right. So you're going for Newcastle as it stands right now. It stands right now, yes. Thank you very much for watching ESPN FC on YouTube. For more highlights, analysis and exclusive content, be sure to subscribe.